All right, we got the jogger. The joker, the joker. Uh, what do I think about this thing? Pretty solid. Pretty solid movie. Um, a little bit late here. Came out on the 4th. I saw it on Monday. Uh, 10.30 a.m., a little matinee action on the ultra screen. Me and a couple other solo dudes, you know, slid right past that no singles policy, past security, and up on into the grandstands, baby, to watch it on that 70-foot ultra screen at the Marcus Theater. Uh, honestly, this thing has nothing to do with Batman. You could you could take out all the Batman stuff in it, and uh, it wouldn't really change anything. If anything, it's gonna make the movie a little bit better. Um, it's really it was a solid contained. Uh, in the Batman universe, I guess in Gotham, but it was a solid contained movie in itself. Um, I don't expect a sequel. I it's it's probably gonna make a ton of money, but I really hope they don't make a sequel. Uh, Todd Phillips, you know, he did a good job on this thing. The guy who directed this also, he read it, he wrote it too. He read it, he wrote it as well. Um, he also directed The Hangover and a bunch of other comedy movies. So I didn't really, I didn't know what to expect going in, in, into this thing. Uh, Joaquin Phoenix's performance is really good. Um, he got hella skinny for this thing. It's, it's pretty gross. Um, he does some weird, nice dances that are enjoyable. Uh, the setting was good. I like that setting, that uh, that nineteen, that late early eighties, I guess late late seventies, early eighties, grime course sleaze fest of New York City. Uh, the music was really good. A lot of good tracks in this thing that uh that kind of take the edge of the movie off a little bit. There's a lot of fun fun kind of tracks. I wish there was more like, you know, Benny Hill during his running scenes and stuff, but yeah. Uh, calf review on this thing. This is a must see for me. This is my top, top film of 2019. I liked it more than once upon a time in Hollywood. I'm not a, not a great, not a big Tarantino guy though. The tomato meter on this thing. I don't agree with the critic score. Uh, I do agree with the audience score though. That's, that's probably fair. I think 70 is a little bit low. 90s probably a little bit high. It's not perfect, but it is a solid, solid movie with a fairly interesting story. It's not too much of a Batman movie. Yeah. Go watch it.